Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Continuous Improvement, your go-to podcast for insights and strategies on leadership and innovation. I'm your host, Victor Lung. Today, we're diving into a topic that many leaders face but don't often discuss openly, the tension between being an expert and a learner. As a solution architect at Thought Machine, I find myself constantly balancing these two roles. On one hand, after four years of working with our cloud-native core banking product, I've gained a wealth of knowledge that allows me to confidently answer client questions and guide my team. However, relying solely on past expertise can be a trap, especially in an industry as dynamic as ours. New technologies, regulatory changes, and evolving client needs mean that continuous learning is not just a luxury, it's a necessity. This tension is particularly evident when leading teams through significant transformations, like, like moving from legacy systems to cloud solutions. These projects require a deep understanding of both technical and business landscapes, but more importantly, they demand alignment between various stakeholders, business and technology teams in particular. Miscommunication or misalignment can derail projects, leading to delays, budget overruns, and even demoralized teams. So, how do we ensure alignment and keep everyone motivated, especially during times of financial constraints or tech layoffs? One approach is to foster a culture of continuous learning and openness. This means engaging with the latest industry trends, attending conferences, and being open to feedback from clients and team members alike. It's about being a learner, even when you're in a position of expertise. This mindset helps in staying relevant and responsive to change. Reflecting on leadership styles, I often think about Alan Mulally's tenure at Ford. He demonstrated a blend of enduring and emerging leadership behaviors, setting a clear vision, focusing on performance, and taking calculated risks. He was also empathetic, inclusive, and humble, traits that are crucial for any leader facing rapid change. Mulally managed the delicate balance between holding power and sharing it, between being a tactician and a visionary. These qualities helped him navigate forward through a challenging period and can be incredibly instructive for anyone in a leadership role today. So as we navigate this complex landscape, the key takeaway is to embrace the tension between being an expert and a learner. This balance is crucial for not only personal growth, but also for the growth and success of the teams we lead and the clients we serve. By applying these strategies, we can ensure that we're well prepared to meet the challenges of an ever-evolving technological landscape and continue delivering exceptional value. Thank you for joining me on this episode of Continuous Improvement. If you enjoyed today's discussion, don't forget to subscribe, rate, and leave a review. Your feedback helps us improve and brings more valuable content to listeners like you. Until next time, keep learning, keep leading, and keep improving.